Hi, my loves. Welcome back to the Stars Cartel channel. If you don't know, I am Star. Whew, baby. Okay, so y'all, I'll, 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 and just like chilling, listening to some jams. Like I, I, I can't stick. That was my party last night. That was my <laughs> after um riding around the neighborhood a little bit. I got my tags. Okay, got my tags. Got my insurance. What your girl was riding around the neighborhood a little bit. Then um my tiny thing came through, and I just sat in my little rocking chair and sipped on me some wine, baby peace calm and you know what i'm saying relaxation you know what i'm saying just i i i'm really um enjoying my birthday i yo i yo i can't stay i've enjoyed my birthday i've enjoyed my birthday and if i don't say it again i'm gonna go ahead and say it now thank you to every single one of y'all that are tuning in to march madness okay something that i have been doing for what 10 years like <laughs> for 10 years offline okay celebrating my birthday and calling it march madness you know what i'm saying this has been going on for a long time and um i am very grateful that i have been able to switch it over to this like format and you know what i'm saying not only use it uh you know celebrating my birthday march madness is my birthday celebration but glorifying god in the process it is a blessing the message i heard is did you have to do that to a sibling <clears throat> the scripture comes from second astrata's Second Estras, I said Estratas again. Second Estras, nine and ten. For as many as in their life have received benefits and yet have not known me, as many as have scorned my law, while they still had liberty, and when conversion was open to them, did not understand, but despised it. Must know it after death by torment. Ooh. So here's the message. You know what I'm saying? We, we live in a world where people really be... Uh, forgetting the purpose of life and you know um people they act as if it's just a game you know what i'm saying and me like i like i was talking about earlier i, I literally i love to enjoy life i like to mind my business and as we say in houston staying out the way that's like I, that's what i do you know what I'm saying? I'm not the kind of person that I am always uh, looking for somebody to argue with. I'm not the type of person where I'm always looking for a fight. I'm not the kind of person where I'm always, you know what I'm trying to find some kind of strife, trying to find some kind of drama, trying to find, you know what I'm saying? And some people are like that. I just feel like this message is about somebody that they... They chose war with you, and they chose to come against you. This does not have to be a literal sibling as in, like, a brother or a sister. This could be somebody that God is calling them your sibling because we are all God's children. And this is somebody that is coming against you for no reason. Like, it's kind of, like, it's stupid. It's stupid. And in reality, I just feel like God is saying, like, you know, sometimes when things like this happen, we think, you know, that it should be a situation where I'm going to pull up on them. Let me grab my keys. Where my keys at? Let me, you know what I'm saying? I'm on my way. Where my sneakers at? I'm on my, where's my, you know what I'm saying? With my Vaseline, with my, you know what I'm saying? I'm on the way. <laughs> 
Let me take off all my jewelry, but leave the rings on. I'm on my way. Noble. <clears throat> God say, in this case right here, whoever this person is, they are so lost in the sauce. They don't even realize, like, they, in their mind, they feel like they winning. And they feel like they won. But, you know what I'm saying? I just feel like this is somebody you see through that. You see through their facade. You see through their lie. You The lie of a life that they live. You know what I'm saying? This could be, like, what I'm really picking up on, this is somebody that they act as if, their life is um, just so awesome and they going to all these places and they doing all these things and they got all this clout or whatever it is they got going on. But the reality of the matter is, mm -mm. and I don't know why, but I am picking up on somebody like that is selling themselves. Like this is somebody that is heavy into prostitution. This is somebody that is heavy into um, doing favors for fame, doing favors for popularity, for clout, for people to be drawn to them. And this person really feel like they on top of the world. They really feel like, you know what I'm saying? That like this is somebody that in their mind they really think that you like want to be them and you don't. You know what I'm saying? Like I just feel like whoever you are, you happy with the simple life. You are happy with your life being the way that it is. Because, you know what I'm saying, me personally, just like I said, what I did, what my activities involved was me by myself sipping my wine and listening to R&B music. That's, that was my night. My, my evening, riding my bike by myself and listening to music as I did so. Spending time with my son. Spending time with my mom. That was... And, you know, to this person, they may, you know what I'm saying, something like that. Oh, that's so boring. Oh, da, 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 da. I would prefer it over, you know what I'm saying, sleeping around with umpteen different people so that they could, you know what I'm saying, pay me some attention. Or, you know what I'm saying, or for pay. Or whatever. Ugh. I'm good. And I just feel like for whoever you are, this person really thinks that you envy them and you want to be them. And in reality, you pity them. Like, you know what I'm saying? You feel sorry for them. You feel like, and the, the pity that I feel for the person that whoever this person is, this person energy, it, it's like they really think that they win it. But... Like in the scripture here, this is somebody, they conversion was open to them, but they did not understand it. They despised it. And God says, they will know and realize all of this when they receive the torment of hell. And to be sad, the, to be honest, the saddest thing about this is, you know what I'm saying? This is somebody that if they was even to hear this message, it would go over their head. It was like the meaning, the truth, the, the depth and the meaning behind this message. It will go over their head. And my heart hurts because this is somebody that they gone. They lost. They and they like, you know what I'm saying? They, 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 whoo brainwashed into thinking everybody want to be them everybody want what they got everybody this everybody that and you know what i'm saying they gone they gone the people that they sleep around with really got their head all the way up in the clouds to thinking that you know what i'm saying and it's sad it's sad and what i am like envision like what i'm being shown in my mind this is somebody that like they'll go out um and they're around you know what i'm saying being around men and being around all kind of people they giving them all kind of substances and telling them yeah 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 you all that you this you that and you know 
pimps do this when they have somebody. When they have a a woman, a young woman that they're trying to get to, they they going they gonna get egg their head up and make them feel as if they all the way up here and everybody wanna be you and da da just like at the end of the Devil Wears Prada when she looked at sis and said everybody wants to be us and she was like I'm in the wrong car. She threw her phone in the in the in the fountain and took off. No. Everybody don't want to be who whoever this person is, they are delusional. I would prefer a very meek and humble life any day over selling my soul. Period. Even if it means I gotta stay at my mama's house. It is what it is. I love my mama. I don't have, you know what I'm saying? Like, even if it, like, even if I got to, you know what I'm saying, work harder to get me something, to get somewhere. Even if, you know what I'm saying, I won't end up, you know, in the best, na of the best neighborhoods and I won't have a mansion and I won't be in a high rise at the top level in a penthouse, you know what I'm saying, and I won't do this and I won't do that. But in reality, I've had those experiences. I've been to a penthouse before. I've been to a penthouse party. It's nice, but you know what I'm saying? Is it worth me selling my soul to live there? No. I've been to mansions. They're nice, but are they worthy of me selling my soul to live there? No. No. I've been in nice cars. I've owned nice cars. But is it worth it to sell my soul just so I can drive a Porsche or a Jag? No. If it's if I just gotta have it that bad, baby, I just give me an old one and fix it up. But in reality, it's not something that I just got to have. And you know what I'm saying? I like I, I just feel so much whoever this person is, pity. It's a pity and it's a shame that this person really thinks that they really got it going on and they really don't. They really think that their life is all glitz, glam, and perfect. And they don't even realize they are on a first-class ticket to hell. That's what they're doing. You know what I'm saying? And that's fine. You know what I'm saying? Like, like I say all the time, not a judgmental person. I mind my business. I stay out the way. If that's what you want to do, boo, do your thing. Do that over there. Don't involve me in your nonsense. You know what I'm saying? If, if you want to thought around for for uh for fame and likes and whatever else, do your thing. Do that over there. Don't try to involve me in that mess. Because I don't want it. Period. That part. I don't mind sitting in my little rocking chair that I that I got for free 99 because it was on the side of the road that I didn't fix up and sipping on my wine. In my mother's garage and listening to music off of my iPad. I'm good. I'm good. I don't mind living vicariously through my Sims. Uh, the, the Grand Theft Auto games or whatever. You know what I'm saying? I, I ain't tripping. I ain't tripping. It's not a situation where I just got to have these things. And, it, and it, it's not so serious that I would sell my soul to get it. Um, I feel nauseous even thinking about what this person got going on. I'm not going to sleep around with random people just so that I can be popular. I'm not. It's disgusting. And the fact that this person thinks that you want to be them is just some of the most arrogant, obnoxious mess. I just, mm-mm. That's the message. Thank you guys for watching. Be sure to like, share, subscribe. Deuces.